Mark, uh, the impact for the red card was clear, wasn't it? Uh, yeah, definitely, definitely. Um, we've just talked to Joe. Probably doesn't need to make that tackle. Um, obviously, coming back here, this is former teams had a, a point to prove. Um, I thought fantastic first first half. Um, just got undone, unfortunately. A, a decision that went against us. Um, but he, he realises a mistake. We've just had a chat there. We, we, we can't win games with 11 players. We don't stand a chance with 10. And, and we've had um, two or three sending offs now, quite quite significant ones. So we need to address that. To counter the man disadvantage, it looked like Louis was the clear option to drop into midfield. Was that the plan? Yeah, we, we didn't have many options, to be honest. Um, so we've, we've, we've had um, a lot of spate of injuries. Four centre midfielders missing today. Um, obviously, we've only got Kino, who's really our, our recognised centre midfielder. Um, again, he's, he's probably got the hump with me because uh, I've taken the, the, the captaincy off him, I've dropped him, I've not put him in squads. Um, but he, I think he, he stood up today, I think mean, he's fantastic today. Um, and again, we're just kind of filling, filling places in around him. Um, Louis dropped in there. Um, but we knew as soon as he drops in there, we've lost our, our goal threat, really. Um, First half with 11 men, we looked compact. We looked we had to win that ball high as well. We looked defensively, we looked very organised. That must, going in 2 0 with a clean sheet, I think the clean sheet was probably the most pleasing part on your behalf. Mm, definitely, yeah. Really positive um, atmosphere at, at half time. Um, done really well. Um, obviously, we're just going to look at the positives at all really today was um uh, just a, a, a free swing cup game not something we were we were interested in winning it's it's about league survival really this season definitely um so a bit of a free swing played well obviously going down the hill um and we were looking just to carry that into the second half um, and just managing the game and then the sending off happens quite quite early in the second half then we're we're up against it um but the effort, the work rate, the determination from the lads was, was first class. You could see that. Um, again, a little bit of naivety. I think we just have to be better at not being beat, just having that, that um, mental strength of, of winning your 1v1 battles. Returning to the league on Saturday, um, was the biggest disappointment from tonight's defeat, like you say, the, men the mentality of not, not, not winning the game? I wouldn't say it's disappointing because we've had that all season. Um, it, it, it's it's so evident. We're, we're not mentally strong enough. When we we're talking about it, and it, that's got to come from. That's nothing that, that I can coach or Emil can coach. It's nothing that Liam or Tom um, can can tell them. You have to have something inside you that stops you from being beat, from stops your letting your man just run off you. If he's stronger and he's quicker um, and he's smart. You have to, as long as you're competing and you're, you're you're being hard to beat, you'd be happy with that. But we're not seeing players um, doing that. Thank you, Mark. Cheers, mate. Cheers, Thank man. you.